Assalamualaikum my dear friends welcome back to my channel I'm your host Abdurrahman Turkwan from Mazar Sharif Afghanistan in today's video I am going to show you how to recover your deleted files from your Android smartphone or tablet in other words how to get back your files from an Android device to do this you must have a rooted Android phone if your device is not rooted then you don't have to worry I've already made a video on how to root and unroot any Android phone with easiest methods so links will be in description below or somewhere on your screen just go ahead and watch that in case your Android device is not rooted to recover our files we are going to use an app which is called disk digger this app is totally free and available in Play Store this app has two versions one is disk digger and the other is disk digger pro disk digger works on non rooted Android phone but it recovers only pictures, not other files like MP3, MP4 videos like that. But this bigger pro works on rooted Android phones and it recovers all the file types. So let's get started. Okay, first of all, let me delete some files from my Android phone. So I'm going to delete some files from my internal storage. I'm going to delete files from my this folder called one as you can see in this folder i have different file types there are mp3 pictures and uh, mp4 videos and also there are some pdf files and now i'm going to select them all and delete now you can see my all files are deleted and now let's go back to the app and try to recover our files first of all open up the disk digger pro when you open it for the first time it will ask you to allow root access so just tap on allow okay after that tap on refresh button which is right top corner and after that select the partition where the files were deleted from in my case I'm going to select my internal storage which is probably this one slash data 11.95 gigabytes I think it is my devices internal storage so I'm, go I'm going to select it after that select what files you want to recover in my case I had pictures mp4 mp3 files and also some PDF files because these these files were deleted from my phone's internal memory so just select that after that tap on ok and it will start scanning now it's scanning my phone for deleted files and now scanning is 2% it will take a lot of time to complete so you have to bear with me this app will also find your old pictures or videos so as you can see now it's recovering old files which were deleted a few months ago okay now scan completed as you can see here it says disk digger has found over 13,000 files there were also 36 audio or video files that are corrupted or fragmented beyond recovery it says there might be some video or audio audio files which are corrupted so let's say okay and now select the files that you want to be recovered it will also recover the files which were deleted on all times let me select my files okay now my selection is completed just tap on the save icon on the right top corner just tap on that after that you have three options the first one is email selected files you can also email the selected files to your friends or yourself or whatever the second one is upload selected file to FTP and the third one is select select file to locally you have to choose and after that select the location where you want to save these recovered files in my case I'm going to save it on my internal storage I'm going to save it to the same folder where it was deleted from so the folder name was one I'm going to select one after that tap on ok and now it's saving files okay now my files are saved okay now let's check it out first of all let me go to my phone's internal storage and the folder was the first one which is one just tap on that and as you can see here are the files which were deleted from my phone's internal storage but there are some video or audio files are corrupted as you can see okay some of some of them playing some of them not playing so if you are in same condition if, if you get some corrupted audio or video files you have to repair your these videos if it's really important to you just go ahead and search on Google for any good video repairing software so you can repair your videos using those soft so guys that's it for today I hope this video was helpful for you if you like this video please share it with your friends and make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel and if this video didn't help you then please do not dislike this video that really hurts instead of that 
go ahead and search for some alternatives so guys thank you for watching my video i'll see you next time till then watch other videos on my channel and goodbye